Hey everybody, this is Brett, and today I'm gonna go over this 2022 Dodge Charger RT with the Daytona package on it. I'm gonna go all the way around in this video. We're gonna check out the interior, all the options. We're gonna start it up, take a look under the hood in this video. First off, this is a 2022. The Daytona package is on the RT package. It's a package on top of the RT. It has the 5.7 liter V8 Hemi engine with the MDS uh, capabilities where it shuts down four of the cylinders on the highway. This one's gonna get you 370 horsepower and 395 foot-pounds of torque. The color on this one is Frostbite. Uh, exterior paint is what they call it. It's actually kind of a tint coat. We're gonna go up to it in just a little bit and get a really good look at it. Uh, but the paint code for this is PCA, if you were curious. This one's gonna get you 25 miles per gallon highway, 16 city for a combined average of 19 miles per gallon. This particular car has the technology group. It also has the performance handling package and it also has the driver convenience group. Uh, the other options on it are the sunroof and the red brake caliper group. So um, we're going to go all the way around it. Let's start off by taking a look under the hood. Once again, under the hood, we have the 5.7 liter V8 Hemi engine. It has the MDS system, which shuts off four of the cylinders on the highway. 370 horsepower, 390 five foot-pounds of torque. You can see that it comes from the factory with the Mopar cold air intake, and it is a true cowl induction hood. There is your emission sticker. Um, really tried and true to engine, of course. And uh, once again, 25 miles per gallon on the highway, so if you do a lot of highway driving, this might be the right car for you. And it achieves that by shutting off four of the cylinders on the highway to get you the better fuel economy. 16 city and an average of 19 miles per gallon. Let's take a look at the original window sticker and uh, check out all the options on there and pricing. Here's the original window sticker. You can see it is a 2022 Dodge Charger RT Daytona. Frostbite exterior paint, black interior Daytona loco logo Napa and Alcantara seats, um, has a 5.7 Hemi with MDS, eight speed automatic transmission. Everything on your left there is your standard equipment. Uh, feel free to pause this, I'm not gonna go over everything except the optional equipment here. Frostbite exterior paint is a $95 option. The Daytona Edition Group is $3,995. Gives you the logo, uh, Daytona logo with the Napa and Alcantara seats. Vented front seats, black edge premium floor mats, rear seat armrest with storage cup holders, uh, everything there, heated seats, heated second row seats, and uh, all that good stuff. And then you get more into the real Daytona package where de Daytona decals, hood, roof, trunk, Daytona instrument panel, satin black charger deck lid badge, Daytona front grille badge, black one piece performance spoiler, the heated steering wheel, power tilt telescopic steering column, the 20 inch by nine inch low gloss granite crystal wheels and the carbonite interior accents, which are really cool. We'll go over those in just a second. The tech group is a $1,895 option, gives you advanced brake assist, rain sensitive windshield wipers, lane departure warning plus, automatic high beam headlamp control, full speed collision warning plus, and adaptive cruise control with stop. Has a performance handling group, which is a $1,095 option, Gives you the Brembo four piston fixed caliper brakes, the flat bottom steering wheel, high performance suspension. And then the driver convenience group is 1480. Gives you blind spot indicator with memory power heated mirrors and front and rear LED map, pocket, map pop pockets, bifunctional HID projector lamp headlamps, deluxe security alarm and locking lug nuts. Power sunroof, which is 1295, and the red brake calipers are 595. Total MSRP is 5355 on this car. If you want to get your summit price with all the rebates and incentives on it in the upper right-hand part of the screen is a link to our website, so you can click that and check us out there. Three-year 36 bumper-to-bumper, five-year 60 powertrain. There are your miles per gallon and greenhouse and fuel economy ratings, as well as your crash test ratings. 
So a lot of five and four stars up and down the board. So a very safe vehicle. Let's check out those rims and then we'll take a look in the trunk and then go over the interior. All right, so we have the 20 inch by nine inch granite low gloss rims, which are specific to the Daytona package. And this car, it comes with Goodyear Eagle RSA tires. These are 245-45 ZR20s. You can see the heavy duty Brembo brakes there with the red calipers. Gives it a really nice look. And uh, the locking lugs must be in the trunk because uh, this one just has the normal lugs on it, but really good looking rims. I'm going to head to the back of the vehicle so we can take a look at the tread pattern a little bit on the tires. So you can see that kind of a little bit more of a sporty tire on there. And of course, four wheel disc brakes. Now coming around on the outside here, the Daytona stickers. You get this sticker, that sticker, the one piece low gloss deck lid spoiler, of course, the LED tail lamps here. You get the chrome tipped dual rear exhaust. And uh, the other thing to note is that is wrapped as well. That's not paint, that's actually a wrap. And then you get the decal on the hood there. So those are all the Daytona specific um, stickers that they're talking about on this particular car. And we'll take a look inside the trunk here. I like that you press the button and the trunk opens up all the way instead of kind of stopping halfway. Uh, that's really nice. This is for your box for your pedals and stuff. This one comes with the tire inflator kit and this is also where your battery is located. Those seats do fold down for extra storage. Let's take a look at that frostbite paint because it does have just a little bit of metal flake to it. It's kind of like a tint coat, but I guess you could consider it a metallic paint. It's really a cool color. I think they started using this color in 2000. Uh, let's go take a look at the interior. So here is the Napa leather with the Alcantara suede. Um, this outside is leather, this interior is suede. You get the Daytona stitched into the backrest. Uh, really good looking, and that is on both front seats. And they're highly bolstered, so they really hug you. Um, they're heated and cooled, power driver seat, factory floor mats. Uh, this one does have auto headlamps, the power tilt and telescopic steering wheel. And you do get power windows, power locks, and memory driver seat. It does have the Alpine premium sound system, uh, you get the leather bolsters on the doors as well and this nice thin uh, gloss black trim on the doors as well. Now as we hop inside, before we take a look at that instrument cluster, I want to point out this carbonite trim. This is what this is part of the Daytona package as well and specific to the Daytona package. Um, really a cool design and it's not just a design, it's actually there's texture to the dash. So. It's, uh, it's pretty neat. And then of course you get your adaptive cruise controls, your normal cruise controls, Bluetooth information center controls, the flat bottom steering wheel, and um, you know the Dodge logo on there, the thumb pads on the steering wheel, and then the paddle shifters on there. We'll turn the ignition on so we can check out the um, instrument cluster and then the radio and everything that this car has to offer on the interior here. All right, so you do get the digital speedometer on the seven inch LCD display. Pretty much everything is configurable on the corners. You can add miles per gallon, miles to empty, um, trip, all that good stuff to this instrument cluster. You can configure that. Uh, it has the heated leather wrap steering wheel. I'm guessing it's heated, it is heated. And uh, you can control that on the 8.4 inch radio here. This is the 4C radio. There are your heated and cooled seat buttons as well as your heated steering wheel. You get AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio capabilities. You can do your climate controls here as well. I'll just turn this on so we can see how that works. Now you can control everything up here or you can do it on the more tactile buttons down here. This one comes with Super Track Pack. Um, 
which gives you the performance pages up there. You have a launch control as well, um, drive mode setup. You have all your different, oops, you have all your different apps on here. That's your settings. There's your performance pages. You have projection manager where you can project your cell phone to the screen. So that's kind of the cool thing about this radio is while this one doesn't have the factory navigation system on it, project your cell phone to the screen. And if your cell phone's got Waze or Google Maps, it'll go right up on the screen and you can use it through the screen on your phone. Uh, it's really a cool system. We actually did a demo on an 84 uh, 4C radio with Android Auto. If you want to check that out, that's in the upper right hand part of the screen as well. So a uh, very, very cool system. And uh, as soon as we're done in the interior here, we're gonna go start the vehicle up and do a final walk around with all the lights on. So definitely stay around for that. Eight speed automatic transmission, your keyless entry with the remote start. You get that carbonite um, trim on the center console there as well, which is pretty sweet. Uh, you get the Daytona badge on the dash. Looks really good. And of course, this one has the power sunroof. Up here, you get map lights, home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lane systems, and assist and SOS buttons in the rear view mirror. Let's take a quick look at the back seats, and then we'll start it up and do the final walk around here. So the back seats have the same uh, design as the front seats. They just don't have the Daytona stitched into the backrest. You do get latch child safety system. These seats fold down like so, and they have this little handle right here, which releases the latch right there to let you pull that down. And then you saw that there were cup holders right here. There's also a little storage bin as well. Now these back seats are heated on the outboard side, meaning the driver and passenger side are heated. You do get two USBs. So like the center part wouldn't be heated, um, but the outsides would be. And then you get the floor mats back here. Lots of room, very comfortable back here. A decent amount of head space as well. And you do get child safety locks on the back doors. All right, we're gonna start it up and uh, take a final walk around with all the lights on. good that 5.7 Hemi once again 370 horsepower 395 foot-pounds of torque let's do the final walk around here I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today and hopefully uh, you enjoyed the video tried a little bit different style on this one and uh, if you liked it give us a like and you can subscribe to my youtube channel which is youtube.com slash summit auto new videos up just about every single day you get the Daytona badge on the grill there. Really a good looking car. Fully functional hood scoop. Then you get those HID headlamps, the LED running lights that go around the ring there. It does say Dodge on the side of those HIDs. And then you get the LED fog lamps, which are super bright as well. Now you can take these off. Uh, they're to be removed by the dealer at time of delivery, so these don't get all scuffed up on curbs and whatnot. But uh, thanks for checking out the video, hope you liked it. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. And to see more pictures of this car or one of our other 550 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, sports cars, Chargers, Challengers, you name it, we got it. We got a lot of sports cars. So go check us out at that website right there, summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle from two locations, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on this video and all the videos that you see there. Click the bell notifications, and you'll get updates on the videos I do each and every day here at Summit Automotive. In fact, in a second, you'll see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to more Dodge Charger videos I've done in the upper right, a link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out. And we're super excited to be offering the brand new 2022 Dodge Charger RT Daytona package and Frostbite clear coat. Thanks again for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. I really appreciate it. Thanks again.